If you have a history of trauma, your thinking brain may automatically assume there's something wrong with me rather than there's something wrong with this situation. Denying, suppressing or masking your pain or overriding your neurobiological limits can all be adaptations from your past. When your thinking brain's belief is that you need to be or do more to be complete, you may find that your stress arousal levels frequently go to the point of overwhelm and exhaustion. Forcing yourself to make it work or doing whatever it takes in a relationship can drive this cycle. Striving is a way to avoid pain. And the longer the struggle is against reality, the more that pain can build. This can set you up for emotional suffering, dysregulation, and even physical illness. It's sometimes necessary to push yourself outside of your comfort zone to grow. And this is okay, provided that you get the chance to recover fully from that stress activation. Autonomic awareness gives you the ability to see things as they really are, rather than always internalizing the belief that you should be doing more or that you're falling short. As you cultivate it, you can learn to work on a more even keel. The more clarity that you have about the reality of your neurobiological limits, the less you'll bite into the belief that there's something wrong with you. This will help to improve your psychological and your physical health, but it will also have a great positive influence on your relationships as well. You can learn to work with your nervous system rather than buying into the fear and the shame that drive nervous system dysregulation.